Hello, g'day, and how you going? Did you see part one of this video? Did you notice anything funny about it? Did you know that I cheated? Did you know it wasn't really about the cheating, it was just to create a nice video? So the cheating didn't really matter as far as I'm concerned. Hi, Stuart here. This video was brought to you by you because you subscribed. Thank you so much. So how did I cheat? Well, this is part two, let's find out. I really thought I should come clean about this video deception. All was not as it seems. I thought it was a great example of telling a story from different flights by pooling all the resources to do so in the process. Did you spot the issues? That is, if any were noticeable, I guess you'd have to know. The only real giveaway might be that some of the cockpit conversation didn't match what was going on. Did you notice? There's a plane over there on the ground, near the ground. Looks like another runway over there. Yeah, there is. Oh, that's not it though. So why did I do this and what happened for me to do this? Well, I decided that the video of the sunset, coastline and flying in circles, combined with rising up over the clouds at sunset, combined with the telemetry, was just too good not to produce a video. But there were issues with the recording equipment on both flights. So I would need to combine the video and audio from two separate flights. Fortunately, you'll find out how I did that soon, what made it easy. I made the executive decision to demonstrate how resources can be combined to create an interesting, informative video out of pieces, and I might just pull it off. Us now is a runway that I want to land on when I get permission one day. Oh yeah. This is technically an island. Yeah. Because it's got a creek right around it, it's all cut off from the mainland. Oh yeah. Both flights had been conducted to the same location within three days of each other. That was the fortunate bit but with two different passengers. Hi. Hi. That was unfortunate. See you on the other side. What's hey. your name? What? What's your name? Graham. Graham who? Graham Foster from Brizzy. Okay, just so we can identify you later. <laughs> Thanks mate. <laughs> Mark's ready to go. I think. That's where it now gets interesting. Mark was my first passenger. At the conclusion of the flight, I had video from two cameras and the cockpit audio recording, but no telemetry. Graham was the second passenger. I had video from two cameras, one of which included telemetry. His flight had the circling orbits and the magnificent cloud flying at sunset. In summary, to create the final video, Flight one gave me the cockpit audio, necessary because this makes the videos more interesting for you to watch. Flight two gave me the cloud flying video from the two cameras and telemetry. I hope you enjoyed the flight video and if you haven't watched it already, I'll put the link up in the corner now. And this, this video, the behind the scenes production video, I guess in future you won't believe any videos I produce, but rest assured I will confess if there is any artistic license in play such as this. This video is brought to you because you subscribed. Thank you so much. Did you realise that YouTube subscribers on this channel are getting notified as soon as the video is released? 
subscribe, hit one of the two thumbs and hit the bell for notifications. Don't be the last one to find out there's a new video online. So before you go next committing aviation, here are two videos I thought you'd enjoy in the meantime until the next episode.